So this is Jessica's level of puzzle. That's what they bought her. This is Derek's level of puzzle. That's what they bought him. <laughs> Hundred pieces of intense Spider-Man action. One, two, three, four, get my shoes and out the door. Five, I'm alive, six, seven, eight, feeling great. Now I'm gonna shine, life is good. I'm doing fine, and gonna do it right and do it again, yeah. I look into the sky with all the beautiful color, but there's more than just for me, so gonna share it with another. I got to show, to give, let out, I want to sing and shout. Take a look and see a beautiful morning that turns into a beautiful evening, and together make a beautiful life. And if you want to. Morning, guys. I am headed to my car to head into work with my mother this morning and it is slippery I know this looks like it's like you know dirty or whatever but it is really slippery and look at this is just completely glare ice all the way to my lovely little car way over there Ooh. 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 Ah. I thought there's birds out this morning there's birds up in that tree. Hooray! Spring is eventually coming. Hooray! Ooh. Okay. Talk to you guys later. Check it out, guys. 40 degrees. Woo woo! But it is actually super de duper de rainy out. Ugh. It is quite disgusting out. But I'm headed home finally and headed back to the girls and uh, don't really have any plans for tonight. don't know. I'm going to call Derek and see what he thinks he might want to cook for supper. My brakes are wet so they're really, they're really, really good right now. <laughs> so when I tap them I jolt forward. But anyway, so I'm just uh, on my way home. So I just got home and uh, take a look at what I found. Yes, we still haven't quite taken care of our um, Christmas stuff yet. Like our, um, like just basically like stocking stuffers and stuff like that. Well, take a look at what I found when I got, just got home here. Take a look. We've got some toothpaste that has been thoroughly chewed on. And the wrappings of the toothpaste that have been thoroughly chewed on and is everywhere. Now, who do you suppose, let's, let's figure out who may have done this. Sophie, was it you? Did you do that? Oh, I think she might be a little guilty. Did you do that? Did you have to play a part in that? A little bit? You might have done some of that once you got it out, probably, huh? Yeah. That's the look of a guilty puppy. But let's, you know, we gotta check with both potential culprits. Molly, did you do that? Molly, what's that? Hmm? Hmm? What's that over there? They both look pretty guilty. Look at her look over at it. What did you do? Hmm? What'd you do? Oh well, that's just Molly for you. Yep, usually, and usually I'm pretty sure I figured it out. Molly is the one who will get it out, start tearing at it, and then, you know, a little later on, little Miss Muffet will join her and destroy the little pieces of that she hasn't yet. Oh yeah, look at Rolling over. You did it, didn't you? You did that! Some of you may, um... Be wondering, you've probably seen it in the background, this uh, yellow dress and white dress. Well, some of you probably already know the white dress is my wedding dress that I love and I just don't have space for it. This dress 
It is not a bridesmaid's dress. I've had a couple of people ask me if it was a bridesmaid's dress, and no, it is not. It is actually a bell dress that was custom made um, to fit me, and it is for a recital. And I actually have the hoop skirt somewhere, too, that makes it nice and full. For those of you who have been wondering and wondering and wondering what the heck is that yellow dress, it is my bell costume for recital. And I don't have a good place to hang it, just like I don't have a good place to hang my wedding dress. So they're chilling together right in our kitchen. Did you already organize some of this stuff? Uh, not really. Not really? Well, you did a pretty good job then, because this looks like mostly utility stuff. Well, I guess we got some serving spoons in there. Yeah, there's like, there's a lot of toiletries and also kitchen supplies. Yeah. So this And a pair of socks. Can mostly go to the kitchen and the bathroom. Oh, it's a good pair yeah. of socks. <laughs> You're so funny. You love socks. I, I, I have... Would you say more or less so than you like your shirts? Um, I don't know. I'm pretty fond of socks. Is that Mentos? Apparently. What's you that? had me at Wolf. But that dog clam. is so cute. It's a cute little doggy. <laughs> Got that for Christmas. Got to read that. So I'll go on the bookshelf. Plane tickets. Well, oh yeah, I was telling people about these. This is what it looks like. Oh, I can't even focus it. Happy anniversary, two tickets to paradise, pack your bags and leave. Whoa, what was that? <laughs> leave September 2014. How awesome of a Christmas gift is that? We always get fun things like this. Where are you on the night of tonight? Um, right here. What's in that bag that you're putting in there? Nothing? Bags and bags and bags. Bags and bags and bags. Bags and bags and bags and bags and bags. Those last two bags that you put in there would be the perfect size bag if you forgot your lunchbox. Perfect. Although should... it's a little late because they have Santa on them. Yeah. Santa's washing all year long. <laughs> so he knows whether or not you get cold. True statement. Ah, left the price on it. I love kitchen stuff. You do? I love kitchen stuff. And you want to get into cooking again. I do want to get into cooking. I was looking at the cookbook yesterday. I think I want to make a meatloaf. Nice. Like, I don't know. I've never made a meatloaf, but. Maybe if you guys have any tips. Tips are certainly welcome. Derek's going to attempt a meatloaf. We need your tips. If you have any, please leave them in the comments below or call us if you know us. Text us. Message us on Facebook. Whatever. You know, it's becoming a common theme that you get really distraught whenever I talk about cooking. <laughs> it's only because I love you and I really want to enjoy what you make for me. Well, I think we're going to head to bed, guys. It's been a long day for me, at least. It's busy for you. It's been, today's been kind of casual, but I'm getting a little stressed out more for tomorrow. Tomorrow's going to be the big day for me, so... Yeah... I'm headed back up to the school tomorrow, so fingers crossed I do okay. I don't know. I freak out about this. He always has my back, so. Um, but yeah, time for bed for me, definitely. Thanks for watching today's video. Uh, if you want to follow along with it, make sure to hit the subscribe button on YouTube. Uh, that'll let you keep track of our videos. And if you're enjoying the video, feel free when you're over there to hit the little thumbs up button. Uh, just sends a like our way and lets us know that you guys are enjoying the things. Um, thanks again for checking them all out. And we'll be back with you tomorrow for more entertaining Derek and Jessica videos. Bye. Night. Beautiful morning that turns into a beautiful evening and again